Hey, what's up guys? It's Nick White. Do uh, tech and coding stuff on Twitch and YouTube. Um, and I do every leak code problem. And I've got a ton of them up on my channel, so go check those out if you want them to explain to you or just do want to do them and get another perspective on them. So uh, everything's in the description too. So this one is called Find Largest Value in Each Tree Row. Uh, you need a pretty self-explanatory. You need to find the largest value in each row of a binary tree. So if we look, we're going to output an array, uh, a list of integers, and we're going to traverse this tree and get the largest value in each row. So one would be the largest value because there's only one thing in the row. Three would be the largest value because there's only three and two, and three is larger than two. And then nine is the largest value in the last row because it's five, three, nine, and nine is the largest out of those three numbers. So to do this, uh, it was pretty intuitive after doing a bunch of other tree problems. It's kind of just a basic traversal solution. Um, so we're going to declare our output array first, list of integers. We'll call it largest vals because that's what we're getting, the largest values in each row. Um, it's going to be an array list. And then we're going to use a helper method. So we're going to call our helper method. Uh, you can call whatever you want. Uh, like DFS or whatever if you want to because um, it's kind of a depth first search we're doing here in a way um, so we're doing a calling our helper method and we're going to pass in the root our array our largest vals array and then the current level we're gonna keep we're gonna keep track of the level as we go through and we're gonna check in the array in our helper method if the element that we put in at the current level is smaller than the element we're taking in. I'll explain it a little bit better in a second. And then we're going to return largest vowels. So helper method is going to update largest vowels. So our helper method is going to be a void method, right? And it's going to take in exactly what we said here. So a tree node root, uh, our list of integers, uh, largest vowels, and then our level, int level. Um, oops. So just like all these other problems, if root is equal to null, we're just going to return. It's a void method, so you just return nothing. Um, and then here's where we actually do stuff. So if level is equal to largest vowels dot size, we're going to just add the root. And why do we do this? largest vowels dot add root well this means that we're given we're at a current level so if we were at level two for example and there's only um, two elements in there should be we're checking to see if there's we haven't even tried to put an element in at the current level yet so if we haven't put an element in at the current level even if it's not the maximum element at the current level we're just going to add anything, and if, and then it's going to. We're doing all these recursive calls, and we're going to visit every node anyway. So if we do already have an element at the current level, so this is in the other case, then we're going to replace that. We're going to replace that value. Might not replace it with. In set, what set does is it takes the current index in the list and sets that value. So else we already have a value at that current level and we're going to replace it with the math.max between largest vowels dot get um, at that level and root dot val. Right? So we're getting we're checking what's in there already and ch checking it against the root of this current call. And if the root's value is greater, we're just going to replace that value so that we have the absolute max for that current level. Uh, and then we're obviously going to have to do our recursive calls on the left and right nodes. So root.left. So the left node here, passing up the same stuff. And we have to increase the level with each call, just like all these other tree methods. Uh, it's kind of tough to explain. Hopefully I'm doing an okay job. Are just vowels, and I have a lot of people talking around me too. Um, so this should do everything right there. Uh, let's submit it. No method found for largest vowels dot add root dot val. Sorry about that. Oh, noise.
There we go, success. So, yeah, basically, you have this largest values of integers, uh, you have this array of integers, and you're doing recursive calls, you're traversing every node, and then at each level, you're adding the, you're just adding, you're adding first, the first node you see at a current level, so if we saw, if we saw two first before three, we would just put two into the list, and then three is going to get seen anyway, so when we see three, we would see the two's already in the list, and we would replace it, because we would check the max between three and two, three is greater than two, so we would just replace it in that list at the current level, so, and then you're just incrementing the level each time and doing the recursive calls on the left and right node. You're visiting every node and you're getting the max at each level. It's a pretty, it's not that bad. Hopefully you guys can kind of read into it a little more if you didn't understand. Let me know in the comments if I didn't do that good. It didn't feel like I did that good at explaining this one, but, you know, I'm trying. So, uh, thanks for watching. I have all these other videos. Uh, I do a lot better in other ones, but uh, thanks for watching and check out the other ones. So, thanks. See ya.